dear friends this is my tutorial 49 in VASP so in this tutorial I'm going to teach you how to calculate the selectivity of COOH or OCOH with H absorption so before going to do your uh, CO2 re reduction reactions you have to calculate the binding energies of the COOH and COCH with H absorption this is the important uh, two intermediate for CO reduction this is the one important intermediate for hydrogen absorption so you have to calculate these three absorption and then you have to plot this kind of figures then you have to calculate that uh, selective of uh, catalyst this is some catalyst may be HER selective some catalyst may be CO2 or selective so you have to calculate this first before going to your uh, to a full uh, catalytic mechanistic uh, pathway of CO reduction reactions. So I will tell you how to calculate and how to plot this kind of fly, uh, profiles. So this is the my paper only I have published recently that I am to C to MX in supported single atom catalyst for efficient and selective CO reduction catalyst. So this is the paper. So this is the graphical abstract for my paper actually here yeah, the CO2 this is that uh, Fe catalyst so it will take proton and electron to produce methane so for that paper I have calculated this profile uh, to check the selectivity for uh, CO reduction or HER HER so we have to first this is that I y, y axis we, we have to put that uh, that COH and OCH absorption energy in that uh, X axis we have to put that uh, H plus absorption energy if you want to know more how to calculate that uh, uh, free energy calculation of H and free energy calculation of uh, this intermediate I have pr produced uh, some uh, earlier lot of videos uh, about this just you can watch that video then you can make this kind of profile easily So this is the dotted line. This is the dotted line. So the top of the things are HER selective, and the bottom the CO2 or R selective. So I will tell you only one example here. So you can see this is the Fe catalyst. This is the two Fe. So this uh, circle the dotted one is OCH2 intermediate. This is star uh, that star uh, diamond one is that COH absorption. So so down one is that uh, HER. Uh, absorption energy so if you see here so this is that zero so if you see this is the uh, slightly positive that I, 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 I h plus absorption energy so if you come here it will come that uh, after the zero that means this is a positive energy so if you see here the co uh, C och absorption energy you can see here so if you go here you can see significantly negative energy that means around uh, so here this is the 0 0.25 maybe 2526 something is there so that means this is the the um, formation of this OCH in, in, intermediate is the negative that means uh, this is the strongly absorbed compared to the H plus that means this Fe catalyst the selective towards the uh, CO2 or catalyst compared to the hydrogen evaluation catalyst so likewise you can see here the PD catalyst So PD catalyst that you can see that H absorption energy uh, that is 0 0.5 so after 0 0.5 is there so if you see that uh, uh, the COOH or uh, COOH or OCOH absorption energy is more than uh, more than that H plus absorption that indicates that that this catalyst is COHE uh, or selective this PD catalyst this copper catalyst are uh, HER selective compared to that uh, CO2 or uh, selective so likewise you have to calculate that the uh, binding energy of this two and also H plus and you have to plot uh, like this plot you have to make sure that means that uh, the range should be the same you, you, see, you, you, you can see here I, I started minus 1.0 here 1.5 here also I started 1.0 here also 1.5 so you should be that the same uh, Y and X axis always so you keep in mind you can also calculate this and you can uh, first check the selectivity then you can proceed first further mechanism 
so i have plotted also with this graph in origin i will share to you that plot you, you you can also check and you can also make that kind of plot using my templates so i will show you that uh, um, um, origin file so this is that that origin file so i will open so you can see this is the uh, plotted that profile so here you can see that x axis i have mentioned that h absorption energy so you can see here so this is the x axis i mentioned that hydrogen absorption energy the y axis uh, b and c so i have mentioned the coh absorption and och absorption these are the different kind of just catalysts i mentioned for reference so just you can select uh, these uh, two things you can uh, plot like uh, select and go to plot you will uh, click the dotted things you can get like that just you can make add in uh, up to 0 to 1 uh, 1.5 minus 1 to 1.5 this also minus 1 to 1 1.5 so you can uh, make it like that profile you will get your profile very nicely so that's all i will share this uh, prof uh, origin profile to you you can make use of it So thank you for watching my video. If you like my content, please like, subscribe, comment and share and also please click the bell icon for future video update. Thank you so much for watching my video. So please subscribe my video and uh, please uh, share to your friends and uh, make this channel more familiar for DFT people. So this is very useful for all scientific community. Please uh, share my video, subscribe also. Thank you. Thank you so much. Enjoy.